I firmly believe that art and design are essential skills to be successful in the 21st century, without a doubt. And the reason for that is that because the world is changing faster than ever, because the nature of the problems are, be, are thornier, um, because the situations that we're dealing with now in every business, large and small, are more wicked than before, we need to you know, I'll tap into the power of innovation and creativity. That's not taught in business school. Um, in business school, you're taught very traditional ways of thinking, of uh, solving problems. And the world doesn't work that way anymore. With the, the nature of competition, the s problems of sustainability, you know, all these, other, these factors are compelling us to dig way, more, you know, way deeper into our uh, t uh, bag of resources, our toolkit. And really the, the one thing that we have that is, can't be commoditized is the power of imagination. And I can't think of a better way to uh, bring forward the power of imagination than the power of design and art. Because what it does is it brings forth um, basically the whole human being. I think it brings the sense of aesthetics, the sense of thinking, technical skills are all expressed. People think with their bodies, with their hands, they look, they use their eyes really effectively. And now the world of business, in its desperate attempt to be able to make, you know, create solutions to the problems that it has, is now looking to the artists and the designers of the world to be able to tackle these problems. So uh, I see it every single day. I see some of the most uh, successful people um, uh, in the world running major, you know, at, or have very senior roles in major organizations come from a design background and come from an art background.